I don't know about you, but I am always on the lookout for ways that I can make my life a little bit easier, the things that I can do to get through my day a little bit faster so that I have more time to do the things that I love. And so if you are like me and love a good hack, I'm gonna give you five of my best minimalist hacks to simplify your life and make sure you stay till the very end because I have a special announcement just for you. When it comes to decluttering your clothes, you might have heard the tip about switching around your coat hanger so you know all the stuff that you have worn. Now, although that tip is great, I find it a little bit fiddly and I wanna show you a way that's even simpler. So at the beginning of the year or whenever you want to, you can just slide all your clothes across and put in a divider. This is just a template that I printed off online, but it can be absolutely anything, even a different colored coat hanger. Pop that divider in, and then as you wear your clothes, put your new clothes on this side, and that way at the end of the year, the month, the season, you'll know exactly which clothes you've worn and which ones you haven't, and maybe it's a good idea to look at those and see if you really love it. One of my favorite ways to have a clutter-free kitchen is to put away appliances when you're not using them. But sometimes that can be a pain in the rear and so you wanna make it as easy as possible. One of the things I have found really helpful is to just put on some of these cable clips to anything where the cord doesn't easily go away. These quickly and easily undo when you need to use it, Put them up again when you're finished and then you can put them in wherever cupboard they live. I also highly recommend a little tray if you're going to be putting away your toaster or your kettle. This makes it really easy to just lift it up and put it into a drawer or a cupboard and that way you're not getting crumbs all over the floor. When it comes to minimizing the amount of items that you have, having items that do double duty or triple duty is the way to go. Now this is similar to like a Swiffer style mop, except this is like the dodgy home brand version. But instead of using those reusable Swiffer pads, I just use any sort of microfiber cloth or rag and there is no end to the amount of cleaning you can do with this. If you wanna clean your shower and don't wanna bend over, this is the way. I clean my car, my walls, my baseboards, you name it. You just wet your cloth, stick it in the little holes and then if you wanna clean your whole wall with it, you totally can. You can use dry cloths if you're just dusting. This is an absolute game changer. It takes the place of so many items and all you have to do is keep this one. If you are a visual organizer who sometimes gets a little overwhelmed if everything is out in front of them, it almost seems like your brain is battling against itself. I have a great compromise for you. Plastic containers are an absolute game changer. They allow you to put items away so that things don't feel so overwhelming, but you can still see what's inside. I really like these tall containers that fit into cube storage. I can move them all over my house. I can see what's inside. You can totally label them as well, but this allows you to be able to see everything you have so you don't forget that it's there and you know exactly where it is without being like overwhelmed because everything is just all out all the time. Whether you are just starting your minimalist journey or you have been at this for a very long time, you will always have items that you want to donate. And one of the best ways to keep on track is to make it as easy as possible to donate. So this tip is all about donating everything, including the box. So having just a box that you were going to put in the trash anyway, use that as your donation box. Put it as close to the car as you can so that when it is full, you can put it in your boot and, or your trunk and you can take it straight to the donation center. That way you've always got somewhere where those items can go till you're ready to donate them. 
If you liked these hacks, I have some great news for you. I am so excited to announce that I will be part of the most amazing organizing virtual conference. So no matter where in the world you are watching from, you can join us at Get Organized HQ 2023. I am speaking all about surviving and thriving with chronic illness, but there are so many amazing creators who will be there to talk about everything you can imagine when it comes to organizing and simplifying your home. So if you would like to join us, please click down below on my link and you will get your free ticket to come and join us at this amazing conference. I can't wait to see you there.